guys. Welcome to our channel. We are catching up today. It's been a while since we actually seen each other. So. <laughs> yeah, it was a nice break. <laughs> yeah, it really was. Uh, um, Cisco just came back from Costa Rica. Yeah, that was yeah. a lot of fun. I do recommend it a lot. Um, if you don't have to drive, don't. <laughs> But it is a beautiful like country. Wild Wild West driving. It's crazy. Like there's no <laughs> roads. There's really like two cars at max that could fit. And Scary. it's yeah, you definitely <laughs> know, gotta know how to maneuver a car. Well, not to mention you drove what like four hours from the airport. Yeah, or something? just to get to La Fortuna where we stayed at uh, was about a three-hour drive, three and a half hours under the rain. By the way, it is a rainforest. Um, yeah, no thank you. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I did learn is that Costa Rica likes to preserve their rainforest. That's why they don't have that many roads. And the ones that they do is some snake roads for sure. That's probably good though. Like, it's, I mean, we, we don't really want to preserve desert land here, do we? <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> it's not like ideal, I guess. But, but yeah, it, it was a lot of fun. Cool. I definitely recommend you guys go. For sure. Yeah, while well, he was enjoying Costa Rica. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> well, you know, besides cleaning the house and working and watching the kids, nothing. <laughs> Sounds like fun. Yeah. I didn't actually, miss a lot. <laughs> yeah, no, I didn't. I actually spent the weekend, well, Sunday actually, just like cleaning up the loft in my daughter's room because it's like a disaster. What are you guys doing? Just like uh, getting rid of getting rid of toys and reorganizing. Um, we're doing a new room for my daughter. Oh, nice. She's gonna get, she has our old king size bed and it's just too big for her room. Uh, <laughs> too <yeah>. big. <laughs> and she's what, like tiny six year old. <laughs> she's like, 40 pounds. She, doing it? <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't need a king size bed. <laughs> but that's the room we use for guests when they come. Ah, okay. So we want to at least have like a bigger room or bigger bed for the guests you that know usually sense. it's like a couple or a family comes to stay with us once in a while so you know we want to have maximum room so what we're going to do is get a twin size bed that opens up into a king and it connects like so it's like trundle but it's like a raised trundle oh interesting so okay. ikea actually has a day bed that is a twin and it's like double layers, so you can God, open it up open and then it, it goes to expands. a king size cool. bed. And then it has drawers on the bottom so she could put more junk. But she is a hoarder, like, is she? like her dad. Oh, her dad. <laughs> yes, her dad. <laughs> okay. he, you know how many years we carried around a box full of random wires? Because, oh, you know, one day he might need it. You never so, know. <laughs> but she, I threw away a box and when I wasn't looking, she took it out and hid it behind her door. Oh, no way. So I was cleaning out her room and I opened her door. I'm like, what's that? And she just went, hey. <laughs> <laughs> and then I said, uh, I'm going to throw it away, OK? She's like, OK. So That's funny. we ended up throwing it away. So she just randomly hides things? Oh, she hides throughout. stuff. Wow. She even told me yesterday while we were cleaning, she goes, you know, dad threw away my uh, whatever toys. and." I took it out and I hid it. Do you know where I hid it? I hid it behind my dollhouse. <laughs> <laughs> so she's a little sneak, but it's funny. That's funny. Yeah, super funny. That's pretty funny. Yeah. Um, so what are you guys doing? Like just tossing stuff away? Yeah, or? it's just too much, too much. I don't think we've, maybe in, how old's my daughter? Six and my son is eight. Like we've yeah. probably gotten rid of toys mm, three times. Oh wow. Yeah, so they do not like throwing away stuff. They're very sentimental, so, you know. It sounds like it's a family thing. Not <laughs> Just me. <pour> it. Okay. <laughs> I've been on like a minimalistic kind of like Band right yeah. Now. Yeah, so I just want to yeah. like get rid of stuff and just be clean. Cause like, hello, look at Instagram. Like, there's so many perfect homes. Um, obviously, that's not it's real never life. It's never gonna happen to kids. <laughs> Actually, my friend has a friend that is a uh, an influencer, and I asked, "Is her house always that perfect?" And she actually told me, "No, she's been to her <laughs> house, and it's all for the gram." It's, it's, so it's not possible. Now we yeah. have kids. I'm yeah. glad I, I'm out of that stage yeah. already. Yeah, but does your house look Instagrammable? <laughs> it's not Instagrammable, but it's very minimalistic. It's yeah. funny because my daughter actually complained about that. What? That is too minimalistic. It's too minimalist. <laughs> she's like, "There's no." 
life in this house because it's there's no colors or uh, more more personal stuff or eclectic stuff. So basically, she said you're boring. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> 18 year olds for you. Uh, good old 18 year olds. Yeah. Um, so what are you doing with the toys? Donating it. We threw away a lot of broken ones. Okay. That was like I had a couple big trash bags of broken stuff and random stuff. And my daughter will draw stuff or she'll pick up like a leftover box and oh, I can use it for a toy. It can always <laughs> so, be used. <laughs> I mean, good for her on like reusing, but it's just trash, really. And I see your son has like so oh, many toys. I saw that Instagram goodness. post where he had like the, your whole island full of cars. <laughs> That's nuts. He has a collection of cars and Thomas the Trains. <laughs> so, I mean, each Thomas the Train was probably like $10 and he has a drawer full of it. Wow. So, um, yeah, we're not getting rid of those yet because he goes in phases. He'll like, uh, you know, Disney cars, then he'll like Thomas the Train, then he'll like languages. So he'll do like a bunch of like alphabets and whatever. Okay. Then he'll go back to Disney cars, then Thomas the Train, so and it's just like a rotation. Yeah. So he has them on a, on yeah. a rotation. Got Which it. is fine because it's like a brand new toy again, you know, by the time he comes back around to it. So I don't want to get rid of those yet. One, how much we spent on it. I'm it's not trying to rebuy it. And two, you know, some sentimental, you know, value there. So I know like when my son was going through that stage of having so many toys and stuff will hold up um garage sales oh yeah yeah. and yeah. whatever money he made his money oh. from his stuff so but it was he was never attached to like stuff stuff mm. except sticks sticks he grabbed anywhere we went if he saw a <laughs> stick that could be used as a sword <laughs> okay. or as a walking stick he will pick that up and like he will come into the house from playing outside and like hey look what i found and you just bring in a stick <laughs> you're like oh great firewood <laughs> it, it's crazy because i mean he i named him after uh, darth vader anakin uh, and so everything was a lightsaber eh, um so he sense. really got into that whole character of darth <laughs> vader and everything was a lightsaber for him so That's to this cute. day i think we still have a few sticks in the garage <laughs> That he okay, so for his birthday, I'll get him a stick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's funny. Like um, we toss quite a bit out, but he collected sticks for sure. That's interesting. Well, at least it's not trash like my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's not hiding them behind wall houses. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's funny. Anyway, we're gonna continue our quest on cleaning up the house and getting it ready. Um, I got some like fun organizing and cleaning stuff. Oh, that's so cool. So I can't wait to share that. Um, but that'll be later. <laughs> once she gets to it. <laughs> yeah. Well, once it arrives and I oh, test okay. it out first, then I have to give my full review, you know? That's awesome. So, yeah. So, yeah. This is uh, kind of our daily life right now. Yeah. Good old family life plus work life plus. If vacation. Vacation. Yeah. Highly recommend Costa Rica. Go out there. And I highly recommend throwing out trash <laughs> and old toys. Don't be like a her, like a yeah. hoarder. Don't be like my daughter. <laughs> oh yeah, her daughter. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, well, come back and see us. We will be back with more exciting stuff for you. So feel free to subscribe and uh, comment anything down below. Yeah. You know, if you have suggestions for her to uh, <laughs> yeah. see how to best get rid of those yeah. toys. Or how do I tell my kids, like, it's time to give it up? Let me know in the comments. Um, hit subscribe and turn on your notifications. We will see you soon. See you next time.